What's cracking YouTube? It's your boy though back again with another reaction. We got a recommended video from my guy Jacob Finesse. And uh he reminded me that the NHL official gameplay trailer came out. I forgot all about that. I did react to the regular trailer. My fault. And I think I seen I didn't watch Nasher's video of the gameplay trailer, but I seen that he posted one and I forgot all about it. And that happened what a week ago? Oh my God, it was two weeks ago. Jesus Christ, I'm late as hell. But YouTube, before we get into this, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button for daily bangers, bro. I'm late as hell. Welcome to NHL 22, the first NHL game built on the Frostbite engine and powered by next generation consoles, PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X and S. With the introduction of Superstar X Factors, the Frostbite uh -huh. engine, augmented reality UI, enhanced stick and much more, the NHL franchise is delivering not only the best gameplay, but the best looking game to date. This is Breakthrough Hockey. For the first time ever, the Frostbite engine comes to the NHL franchise, bringing massive aesthetic upgrades to both current and next generation consoles. With breakthrough visual detail in every hit, deep, and shot, improvements can be found on a macro and micro level, including atmospherics such as flares and snow. We've upgraded uh. facial animations and likeness, even so far as to enhance the detail and eye movement and facial expressions that react to the changing environment and events around them. On top of that, detailed enhancements on both player models and game environments have been ramped up, giving both unique character and authenticity. This also includes micro details on uniforms, higher resolution ice, and 3D ice spray that interacts with the environment and can even spray on the camera during replays. Jesus Lastly, Christ. the physically based dynamic lighting system powered by the Frostbite engine unifies all elements within the game. Now, materials like cloth, visors, and helmets react realistically to light. Metal shines like metal, glass reflects the game in real time, and ice glitters depending on the amount of stress caused by the action on the ice. With all these upgrades, NHL 22 makes every rink look and feel like the real deal, including a certain arena that will be hosting its first ever NHL contest this upcoming season. Superstar X Factors is a game-changing gameplay advancement inspired by the unique characteristics of the NHL's best mm. talent that allows you to unleash signature player abilities and elevate the stars of the sport like never before. It's always been a goal of ours to differentiate star players from the rest of the league and with the arrival of X-Factors, you'll feel the special traits of each superstar through specialized gameplay mechanics and visual differentiation. We divided X-Factors into six categories, shooting, skating, passing, hockey IQ, defense, and goaltending. The game features 29 different Superstar X-Factor abilities assigned to players in two tiers, Premier Zone abilities and Secondary Superstar abilities. So whether it's Matthew's patent toe drag wrister, Seth Jones' uncanny ability to intercept pucks, or Vasilevsky's acrobatic robberies, you'll be able to recreate the league's most iconic abilities and use them to gain an edge over your opponent. Makes a move in front, he's Superstar X-Factor span all positions and game modes bringing a new layer of class-based strategy, differentiation, and authenticity. Damn! Speaking of authenticity, we are now doing more with the stick physics to realistically simulate stick-on-stick -stick and stick-on-body collisions. The end results are more accurately represented puck battles on both offense and defense. For instance, attacking players are now able to protect against a defender's stick and mm. drive to the net with force. Four outcomes are dictated by proper body positioning, which decides whether stick interactions get driven through or lead to penalty calls. Our new augmented reality broadcast system animates on top of the action in real time throughout the game, including when one of your special abilities are performed to give you an understanding of its impact. When an exceptional highlight reel moment occurs, 3D graphics will appear over your player, letting you peacock against your opponent that much more. Also, the system injects information instantaneously to the game, helping mm -hmm. you manage your strategy in real time without having to exit the game. These augmented, hyper-real moments elevate the broadcast quality, giving a modern, sleek look to gameplay, all while improving game flow speed, up to as much as 50%. From visual improvements to play innovation, we set out to give NHL 22 a new look and feel for the new generation. The Frostbite engine, Superstar X Factors, and augmented reality graphics are set to deliver the greatest lead forward that the franchise has ever seen. This is Breakthrough Hockey. 
This is NHL 22. Wow. I'm surprised they never had, as an EA game, they never had X Factors. Because uh, Madden's been doing X Factors for a minute, though. So the X Factors sound pretty fucking accurate in this game. I don't think it's going to be many, like in Madden. It's a hell of a lot of uh, X Factors. But the stick physics uh, look, bruh, looks crazy. <laughs> The end results the animations, are more accurately... Bruh, the animations, when you bump into players and all that, look, bro, crisp as hell. Speaking of authenticity, we are now doing more with the stick physics to realistically simulate stick-on-stick -stick and stick-on-body collisions. The end results are more accurately represented puck battles on both offense and defense. For instance, attacking players are now able to protect against a defender's stick and drive to the net with force. Poor outcomes are dictated by proper body positioning, which decides whether stick interactions get driven through or lead to penalty calls. Our new augmented re So I wonder, uh, did they do this stick physics because, um, they had a problem with, in the game, the players would just morph right through the, uh, stick. I think that, that, that happens in 2K a lot where you dribble the ball and the ball can literally go like you, your hands can literally go right through the ball and you will not get a steal or a bump or anything. It'll just go right through your body. So I guess that's it's EA. I mean, not EA, but hockey fans. Is that, is that um, the NHL 22 or 21 games problem was that the stick wasn't realistic. You didn't get no bump animations, no nothing like it just was like, it was there. If you ran through it, you ran through it. Let me know in the comments. Augmented reality, EI, When an exceptional highlight reel moment occurs, 3D graphics will appear over your player, letting you peacock against your opponent that much more. Also, the system injects information instantaneously to the game helping you manage your strategy in real time without having to exit the game. That fire, These augmented, hyper-real moments elevate the broadcast quality, giving a modern, sleek look to gameplay, all while improving game flow speed, up to as much as 50%. From visual improvements, also includes micro details on uniforms. In shot, improvements can be found on a macro and micro level, including atmospherics such as flame. Okay, this is... This was a pretty good gameplay trailer, but uh, I wonder how much this really impacts um, gameplay that much. Like, I understand X Factor is like badges in 2K. It does improve some stats and how things happen in the game. Increases uh, the percentage of possibility of things happening. So I understand the X Factors, the physics for the stick. I understand that augmented you reality ui yeah but is that a big enough impact on the gameplay let me know in the comments because you know i never played the nhl games but you know i i know pl from playing madden in 2k that some some things would be like it sound good but does it really matter you know what i'm saying just let me know if if it if it's really like that, or should I go watch Nashville's video breaking it down? Cause you know he be playing all types of NHL games. But besides that, YouTube man, shout out to my guy Jacob for the uh, recommendation. I'm out of here. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, comment other videos I should watch next, and uh, I catch you on the flip.